down, up, down, up. Oh my god, it's Final Fantasy 13. Oh, I love it. Okay, so... Last episode, I said I was going to stay in this area and just, like, grind out. Like, just do a lot of, like, level grinding and stuff. I think I said, like, I was going to go, like, 100k, like, experience points for the Crystarium, but... I went... I went way over. Over the last week or so, I think I've done maybe... Oh, it's a lot. But yeah, this is this is like a week later after saying I was gonna like grind out experience points and shit. I think I ended up grinding like almost 400k. But yeah, so I, I did a lot. I did a lot. And if I go into the Crystarium... My goal was to get everyone to like level 4. Um, Lightning almost made it to level 4. Yeah, like, as you can see, like, health, strength, magic. They're, like, the last few things. Lightning requires a lot more experience points than everyone else. I didn't actually know that when going into this, but, yeah. Oh, we're avoiding goblins. Goblins are, like, the worst to fight. I've still got a bit of a stuffy nose, um, like, I'm not fully better from when I said I was sick a couple weeks ago. <coughs> <coughs> so sorry about that. But no, we're gonna continue Final Fantasy Thirteen. um, gonna be honest, the break I took from this game, um, after doing all that grinding, I got I got a little bit sad. I got a little bit sad, and that sadness was literally just that I wasn't playing Final Fantasy Thirteen. Okay, I guess we're fighting these guys. Alright. No, oh, no. 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 If I do retry... Okay, so this is like a pro strat. If I do retry, it'll take me just before they, like, spotted me and came after me, so... Let's try and just avoid... I just want to avoid every battle here. Because, as I said, I've... I've spent a lot of time grinding out here, like, a, like a lot. More than I'm willing to admit... Uh, I, I think I said, like, my goal was 100k. I think the total, like, Crystarium points that I ended up gaining for this area... It's above 500. It's above 500. It's... It's a bloody lot. Okay, so... Where am I supposed to be... Where am I supposed to be going? I'm supposed to be going up here, but I'm at this part of the map. Where is that? Where is that? How am I supposed to get there? Okay, I'm actually confused as to where I'm supposed to be um, going right now. I thought I was supposed to just run to like the top part of this map, but... I guess not. Hang on. How the hell do I continue? How the hell do I get to where I'm supposed to be going? Okay, let's follow this right. Let's just follow this path. Let's just follow the map. Okay, that's a dead end. Is that a dead end? Oh, I'm actually confused as to where I'm supposed to be going. Um, this looks like it loops around. Please loop around. 
please loop around. Okay, oh, yeah, so I, I I said my original goal was like grinding a certain amount of experience points and defeating like a big boy. Big boys are hard. They're really hard. Like they actually des. I am so far like higher than I was supposed to be originally. But those big boys, they decimate me. Like, they actually decimate me. Like... Oh, that's insane. I can enter one of those battles if you guys really want me to, just to show you. But, no. Big boys, they be... They be hitting hard. They they hit way, way, way harder than I am. Okay. Okay, good. We're on the right path now. Oh, I want to avoid this. I want to avoid this. I want to avoid this. Yeah, believe it or not, all the um, XP grinding I've done is literally not enough to defeat half the big boys that the... I can't even defeat a King Behemoth. SNOW! I'm sorry, that There's just made me very here. happy to say Snow. No, um... Even King Behemoths are really hard to fight. Um, and I've done a lot, like a lot of battles. I I found the perfect grinding route um, to get, uh, what was it? It was like 100k every like sort of 20 or 30 minutes. It was a very, very good grinding route that I took. I. But no, I did a lot of battles. I did a lot. I got my levels very high. And now I'm continuing because uh, I think I spent three, I think it was 24 hours on my save file. I think it's now 28 hours on my save file. So yeah, I, I spent a lot of time. I spent a lot of time grinding levels, but you know what? That's not what this is all about. This is all about continuing and finishing Final Fantasy 13. So we're on disc three. We're in this nice big open area. Of course it's linear now. Ugh, I don't want to fight these guys. Oh, I don't want to fight these guys. I'm so sick of battling. I've done so much grinding. I'm sick of it. These are a new enemy though. These are actually a new enemy though. I'm... You know what? The game has... It's still throwing new shit at me. It is still throwing new shit at me. Um... Yeah, I guess we'll just see how th this is... These guys are really easy. Am I over leveled now? Oh, did I grind too much? Do I get my Crystarium too high that these guys are now going to be really easy? Oh, I hope so, actually. I... I actually hope so. Like, legitimately, I really hope so. After struggling with Alexander, um, which was Hope's bloody, um, summon. I'm just gonna say summon, so I remember the actual word, the game name. Uh, the game gave to them. My god, I... English is not... Ooh! Is that, um... That was a new weapon. Was that for lightning? It was for lightning. What does it do? Staggerlock. Okay, screw that. Um, we have leveled the hell out of this weapon. But yeah, no, so I said I was going to do a lot of, like, sort of grinding off-screen stuff. I've done that, so now we're back. Now we're back! And I'm... I'm actually super happy that I'm back. Like, legitimately, I'm very happy to be back. As you can see, five ATB bars. Um... Yeah, we did a lot. Of, well, I did a lot. I did a lot of messing around in that big open field area. I did a lot of um, fights. Yeah, it was good. And I was just getting started. I'm a little bit flemmy still. I'm. I'm sorry about that. I am. A, I am still a little bit flemmy. This bloody cold that I've got has lasted a lot longer than I really wanted to, realistically, but... 
You know what? That's why I'm here playing, that's why I'm here recording, that's why I'm here talking to you guys, because, you know what? Screw being sick, I just want to play the Final Fantasies. I want to play the 13th! Nah, um, Final Fantasy 7 is, uh, the remake is... I just want to finish this game so I can play Final Fantasy 7 Remake because I don't... I have this weird thing where I... I wanted to play Final Fantasy 7 Remake. I was like, you know what? I'm not recording Final Fantasy 13. It's been a... It's been like about maybe a week since I last played Final Fantasy 13. Maybe I should try Final Fantasy 7 Remake. But then I was like, on the other hand, screw that because... I don't want to start a new Final Fantasy game while I'm already playing Final Fantasy game because Lord knows the story is already convoluted enough without this and in the time I've been playing Final Fantasy 13 waiting to play the 7 remake they've announced the bloody 7 remake part 2 so it's been kind of a roller coaster. Oh, I'm so behind. But you know what I have been... You know what I have been playing? I've been playing Code Vein. I've been playing a lot of Code Vein. I'm not even gonna lie about that. Code Vein... It might be... It's better than Dark Souls 3. Dark Souls 3 was kind of a letdown. I'm not gonna lie. But Code Vein... Oh baby, that game scratched the itch. Just... You know what? The character customizer... Oh! Oh, it slaps. It slaps! But nah. So, let's continue on our Final Fantasy XIII journey together, everybody. Um, my god, we are a lot of episodes into this, aren't we? Like, a lot. I think this is episode 28, I believe. Yeah, episode 28. So, for anyone that has stuck through me, um, with all of the hours worth of boring shit and gameplay, I'm gonna say boring shit because for me it's been amazing because I've legitimately never played this game the whole way through I've legitimately never even really gotten into a Final Fantasy game but this is the first this is the first Final Fantasy game that I will ever in the history of Final Fantasy actually beat and I'm not even joking when I say that I've only ever beaten like Kingdom Hearts games and Dissidia Final Fantasy yes I I actually really like the city, or I, I very much enjoy the hack and slash genres. I think they're very fun. And I was just getting started. Oh, you were just getting started, were you, baby? Well, guess what? We already finished the combat! I'm sorry, I like giving quips back. I like giving quips to the main characters. <laughs> Man, there is a lot of these dudes. I... You know what the biggest thing I want in this game is? Because, again, I've never beaten it, and I haven't actually looked up anything to do with this game, because I, I don't want to- I don't want spoilers. I'm- I want to play this game fresh. Like, as if it was still 2009 type fresh. I want a chocobo. I want a chocobo. We've had baby chocobo hanging out with Saz. But I want a chocobo. I want to be able to ride around on a chocobo. And I want to have all of the fun. But yeah, I I still know basically nothing about this game. Like, I, I'm one of those people where if a game comes out and it doesn't really interest me, I won't, like, look at lore, I won't look at spoilers, I won't look at anything. So, Final Fantasy XIII, despite the fact that it came out in 2009... 13 years later, ironically, 13, oh, massive pun, but no, 13 years later, I'm still spoiler-free th spoiler on this game. I have no clue how it ends, I have no clue where the story's going, because I've never looked into it, but I'm still playing it, and I love it. I actually kind of adore this game, I think it's very, very much I don't like these big guys, though, oh my god. God, this dude is either gonna kill me in like three seconds or he's gonna be like a cakewalk. Oh, we need to go to Versi. Vanille, baby, heal me. Please, please heal me. 
Ugh. We're back to mashing, eh? Like, I will say, I... I will say we're back to mashing. Wow, he got our health down low fast! What?! What?! How did he get our health down so fast, so quickly? I'm like... Oh my... JESUS! 5,000 damage?! Really? Really? I have been grinding! I've been actually grinding! And I'm still underleveled? What?! Oh my god, oh my god, how much grinding were they expecting? Was- was I actually supposed to grind in the big open area? Oh no, was I actually supposed to grind in the big open area? Because I've already gr <laughs> I've already grinded for like four hours! <coughs> That's not hyperbole! Oh no! If I've ground for four hours and I'm still getting killed by a juggernaut, like, it's nothing. Oh no. Oh no, how much grinding was I supposed to do? Oh no! Oh no! Hey, Fang baby, thank you. You are the girl. Um, let's just quickly Crystarium. Thank you. Um... I wanted to try and get, like, every character to a level 4 roll, but lightning? Oh my god, lightning requires so much more experience points to get to a level 4 roll than every other character. Oh my god, am I actually... What the fuck? Where am I supposed to go? I don't know where I'm supposed to go. I'm just gonna head towards... Yeah, uh, oh damn it, I was hoping to avoid that fight. Oh well. Why is it back there now? Why did it make me fight the Juggernaut? I am so confused! Final Fantasy 13, help me! I'm so confused! Oh. Uh, nah, it, ma it, it makes me happy to be back playing this game. Like, I'm not even lying when I say that. But this game instills a level of joy that previously only Kingdom Hearts really sort of filled. And that's just because... Come on, man. Look at it. Just look at this game. Go back through every episode I've thus far recorded and just tell me that this is not the, gra the greatest game ever fucking made. Because it is. It drives me to drink. <laughs> that was a, that was more silence than I intended. Um, oh god, can I avoid? No, nope. damn it, I can't avoid this one. Ah, uh, I'm just gonna head back towards the exclamation mark and hope that something happens. But I'm very lost. I've spent so many hours grinding in the big open field. It's been oh my god, it's been a week since I last played this game. Like, legitimately, it's been a week, because, um, I played Fable. That's how it's done. I kind of got into Fable a little bit more, because I was like, you know what, I haven't played this game since I was a kid. Maybe I'll try as an adult. <laughs> Fable's great. Fable bangs. Like, it, it really does. It's a banger. Oh, I just wish this cold would go away. I'm so sick of being stuffy. Ugh, that's, I took a week off to get better from having a cold, and I've still got a fucking cold! Oh, it annoys me so much! Futurama, they they talked about how, like, they defeated the cold virus and it no longer exists and then Fry, like, infects the whole earth with the cold. That's what I feel like it's happening to me right now. I... I got over the cold, and then I immediately got another cold. And I'm still dealing with that cold, and I hate it. I hate it so much. I just want to be done with it. Oh my god, what is going on? Why are there so many more of these dudes spawning? Um, I'm, okay, I guess we'll just target this guy and, and hope the best? Boxed flanks. Um, he's a new enemy. I haven't seen him before. Um, but these other dudes, they're really kind of coming in force, so I'm guessing I have to just destroy this big, big boy first. Um, yep, come on. Come on. Come on. Hurry up. 
her. Items, Phoenix and Vanille. Uh, let's just switch to a diversity real quick, just because I don't know how this boss's mechanics work. And Fang's down. Great. Great. Uh, I love it so much. You know, one thing I will give this game is on disc three, which is where I am now, it's, it's gone from, like, just mash the A button and hope for the best, to, hey, maybe put a little bit of thought into what you're doing, and you might win, or you, you may not win, either way. Oh, God, come on. Oh, no! Fangs down to, oh, I need to buy more Phoenix Downs, I only, I had, like, a million of them, and now I've got, like, none of them. Oh, I hate it. Wow, these dudes do so much damage! What is going on? What was the point of grinding out in the Badlands to only be getting my ass handed to me by these dudes? Was I not supposed to, like, stay out there and grind? Was I just supposed to, like, follow the story? Ah, oh, This game tells me nothing and expects everything! That's not even fake! Like... I, I was like, you know what, I've ground like 400,000 Crystarium points. Maybe that means that I'll be able to get through a little bit of these battles easier. Nope, nope, no, 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 nope. Everything you expect to Final Fantasy 13, don't expect anything from Final Fantasy 13. Okay, we're at, it. We're at another exclamation. Cutscene, please cutscenes. I've missed the cutscenes. I've missed the cutscenes. I missed them so dearly. Oh, thank you. Finally, we're back in familiar territory. Cutscenes. I bet it's up digging more tunnels right now. They seem different from all the foul sea we've seen on Cocoon. I want to. I want to fight God again. I hope I get to fight that priest dude again. Then again, we were able to build our village on land. Oh, I hate being stuffy. I hate colds. We lived alongside them, just like you do on Cocoon. <sighs> oh yeah, this is just like Cocoon. I'm glad Saz is back though. I was missing him. Who knows what we'll find? <coughs> oh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I hate having colds. I, I hate it. I really do. I really hate this. I want to talk, but the more I talk, the more stuffy I feel. Okay, is this the way I was supposed to be going? Can I just get a chocobo? Can someone just give me a chocobo? I don't even know if I know the chocobos are in this game, but I don't actually know if I get to ride one. Oh, no. Oh, no. Do I... You know what? I'm not going to say anything because I feel like I'm going to get my expectations up only for them to be crushed. I just really hope that I actually get a chocobo in this game because it's like a Final Fantasy staple. Every Final Fantasy game has had a chocobo. And I want that choke bar. Oh god, Vanille, please, please heal, please heal. We're good. we're dead. We're dead. Okay, only you two are dead. That was How the hell was that five stars? We everyone got exploded from self-destruct. Don't question it. Don't question it. Just don't question Final Fantasy 13. Just don't question Final Fantasy 13! Oh, pray. Oh, it's a pray. Thank you. That's all we needed. We just needed a pray. We just needed the pray on these guys. Pulsework Centaurian. So these are like the uh, Pulsework. Um, what were they? I think they were literally just called Pulsework Workers. I think that's literally all they were called. Okay, but we're back in familiar territory, just progressing. Well, I mean, familiar territory as in I've never seen this area before, but... 
Can we just have cutscenes? I just want... I want to go back to endless cutscenes. I want to go back to hallways. I want to go back to... I just want Final Fantasy XIII back, you know? I just want my Final Fantasy XIII experience to be rejuvenated. Okay, all these battles are really easy. Did I overlevel? I don't know. I don't know if I overleveled. Wait, why am I going down this way when the natural direction was taking me up towards that juggernaut which handed my ass to me? So now we've turned around, we've come back this way, and now we're going this path. This game makes no sense! I hate it! But I love it. So anyway, that's how my week's been going. How's everyone else's week been going? I guarantee you haven't been yelling at Final Fantasy XIII. Unless you have. Have you guys been have you guys been yelling at Final Fantasy XIII? Have you guys been playing Final Fantasy XIII? You better tell me. Or you're grounded. You better tell me or you're grounded. Your mother will hear about it. If you've been playing Final Fantasy XIII without my permission, your mother's gonna hear about this, kids. I don't actually care, but your mother's still gonna hear about it. Because I've got a safe face in front of your mother. She's the one that yells at me if I don't yell at you. I don't even know what the hell I'm saying anymore. I'm just wanting to fucking say shit to progress. Well, we've almost been recording for half an hour, and I feel like, again, NOTHING HAS HAPPENED! Please be a cutscene. Thank you! <laughs> Ooh! Ooh! Let me guess. That's a foul scene? Yep. Busy carving out new tunnels. Okay. Making roads where roads ain't meant to go, huh? Yeah, it kind of sounds like us. All right, really poly. I feel like the game all of a sudden got really light-hearted. And that was an abrupt music cut and an abrupt end to that cutscene, but the game all of a sudden got really light-hearted in the last few seconds. Okay, I guess. Okay, I guess we're just following this path. Wait, how is the Fel Sea carving these tunnels and doing that? I thought the Fel Sea were like the big god dudes, and now they're just... What? I'm actually legitimately confused about this revelation. I thought the Fel Sea were like the big god dudes. Or were they the Less Sea? No, the Less Sea is what we are, aren't we? Oh, I don't know. Making sense of this game is like making sense of friggin' like Mayan like I, I don't know how to translate Mayan into English and I certainly don't know how to translate this game into fucking English Jesus Christ look all I know is I've got the squad and that's all I care about is that we've got the squad, but I guarantee because they've set it up now I have to fight the foul sea that's carving out the tunnels. And everyone's gonna want their opinion on it. Everyone's gonna be like, oh man, you should fight the foul sea and become God! But I don't wanna do that. I just wanna. I just wanna end this game, man. We're so. I, we're so close to the end. We're on disc three. I spent too much time in the big open field because I was just so happy to be in a big open field. I don't know why I did that. I should have just continued the story and just not screwed around with that, but... I don't know, man. I don't know. Life wasn't meant to be straightforward. You know, one thing I have learned recording all of this, I burp a lot. I burp a lot. I really do burp like a, like a bloody lot. 
I'm sorry if that's gross. I'm sorry if that's gross. But I don't care, but I think it feels good. If you have a burp, if you haven't burped, so then you're an alien. Okay, so mental note, in future, just target this dude, like, straight away. You know what, let's, um... Let's, let's just hit retry now that I've got that knowledge. Oh, that's another thing that I learned out in the- I actually did not know that you could retry battles like this. I actually legitimately did not know that. Um, but yeah, no, fighting the King Behemoths, I, I actually learned you can, you can in fact restart battles. So now that I'm aware of this, we can restart fights, I guess, so... Let's just kill the boxed phalanx. Because, like, Jesus Christ, these battles where they can just keep deploying new allies. Holy shit, some of them last a bloody long time when you don't know how to, like, end them. I swear to God I was doing a fight out on the Badlands for, like, a very long time before I figured out, Hey, wait a minute, I can do this? Because, again, it's just not one of those things the game doesn't tell you about. I wonder if we will... Uh, New strategy. Oh, we do. We do. Damn it, I didn't mean to change paragons. I meant to uh, get the meal up. Diversity. There we go. I thought I was going to be like OP as hell coming into this. From all the experience points that I earned out in the Badlands. I'm just gonna call that big open area the Badlands. Um, anyone that's played Borderlands, you will understand why. I love Borderlands. Uh, the first two. I do not like Borderlands. Though. Sorry. But no, um, you guys will know what I'm talking about, but... I actually thought I was gonna be a lot more, like, OP coming into this area, but I guess... I guess stuff scales. I guess this game has, like, scaling or something, because... I don't really feel overpowered considering the level of grinding that, that I just did. Getting started. I guess that area is just supposed to be a one-time thing, but... I don't know, I don't care, we're continuing the story. Let's just fucking do this. Uh, oh, we have to fight this dude. Oh. MANDATORY BATTLES AFTER GRINDING?! MAKES ME MAD! Rust pudding. That sounds like a horrible dessert at like a really cheap restaurant. Ah uh, yes, I'll have two orders of the uh, rust pudding thing in you. I can't be the only person that makes that, uh, surely. Yes, Fang, take him out. Easy. Dave, you're right, lightning and was easy. How many experience points have we earned just from these battles? 27,000. Nice. I wonder. I wonder. If that's enough to get commando. Yep, okay. So, lightning is now a commando level 4. Thank you. Yeah, let's just... There we go. There we go. There we go, alright. Lightning is now Commando level 4. Uh, that's what I wanted to do out in the big open area, was just get everyone to level 4 in just one proficiency. But I guess we've done it. These guys are... They're giving us a lot, like a lot of CP in this area, so we're definitely coming up towards a point in the game where the developers were like, you know what, you're getting close to the end, here's some battles that just garner a shitload of CP, have fun. And you know what, I, I have been having fun. Oh, this is nice, look at- wow, look at this area! This area looks really good. Good job, 2009 graphics. You did it. Yay! Xbox 360! 
You finally, um, look like a PS4. They could actually release this game on PS4 and I don't know how many people would be able to tell the difference in graphics fidelity. This is so wholesome. Why is this a cutscene though? Where did everyone else in the party go? It's just Vanille and fucking Fang. Where's everyone else? I scarred Cocoon. And I left Grand Pulse in this mess. It was me. Good for you, baby. What are you talking about? It all came back to me. Everything that happened with our focus. <laughs> How the hell were you, Ragnarok? No, it's the truth. Elaborate. It's all my fault. Don't say that. <laughs> oh my god, Daniel. Yeah, so everyone had like this crazy moment of like screaming and hatred. And now I guess for Neil's summon is just this. The Eidolon knows the truth. Oh, I'm not looking forward to another Eidolon battle. Wait, so you were lying? No more than you were. Admit it, you remember everything. It wasn't. It wasn't your fault. What the hell is happening right now? This cutscene has just lost me. This cutscene just lost me. I'm lost. Where did everyone else go? Wow, these are all very useless. These are all very useless. I'm guaranteeing I'm gonna fail this bloody idol on battle because holy crap! What is what is this setup? What is this setup? This is so bad. This is really bad. Like, actually bad. I'm not all smiles and sunshine. Guess we better heal ourselves. What the hell is going on? This feels very unwarranted compared to the other guys. <coughs> like, the other guys' idol on battles were, like, kind of set up a little bit better than this one. This was like a cutscene, and nothing, followed by, hey, BT Dubs, here's an Eidolon battle. Oh god, this is going very poorly, isn't it? I have no idea how the hell I'm supposed to do this. I'll deal with you. So any information yields though yeah chain bonuses everyone everyone yields to chain bonuses no time to panic. and a retry yay wrong? yay the retry how the fuck am i supposed to be where's lightning where's every other character that i Fucking had up to this point. What is this? Were they just trying to cram these idle on battles in because they're like, oh fuck, the game's almost over. We better, we better give hope and vanilla an idle on battle. Oh, oh, I tell ya, we need those idle on battles, boys. All right, let's give this another shot. Um, yes, yeah, skip. Whatever. Shut up. Okay, I guess we can do some fucking paradigms. Let's do that. See, again, this is what they should have had at the start of Hope's Battle. Like, this is actually what they should have had at the start of Hope's Battle. Um... Yeah, let's, let's just try that. Let's just see how that goes. How come this one do Okay, why was Hope's Battle such an outlier of fucking bullshit where, like... Hope's Battle with, um, Alexander was such a... An outlier in terms of just... Oh my god, what were they thinking? But now we get to start from that menu... Where we get to choose our paradigms... And we get to... 
do this? What? Why was Hope's Battle such an outlier? That's so weird. This is really weird. Why was Hope's Battle so shit? Did even the devs know that Hope was just like a worthless character? I'm beginning to think that. I'm beginning to think that even the devs thought that Hope was a fucking worthless character because... And every time we had to, every time I KO'd his battle and had to retry, we didn't get to set up paradigms like Fang and Vanille, but now we do, so... I don't even know anymore. Sorry, I have to concentrate just like a little bit for this because I don't know what I'm supposed to be doing. I do not know what I am supposed to be doing. What's uh, what's gonna get the bar up the most? <coughs> so Saboteur makes his bar go up very quickly. We know that much now. Um, let's try and heal Fang real quick. Or not. Let's try this one. I'm guessing Saboteur and Sentinel will be the ones that I want to do for this battle because Saboteur seems to be putting his bar up very quickly. I think we're gonna fail this but that's alright. That's alright, I'll just try again. I'm guessing Saboteur is what's going to make his bar go up very quickly. Oh, come on. Can something happen, please? No choice, I guess. Okay, yeah, no, we're screwed. There's no way we're getting this stalled on this. Yeah, there is no way we're getting into the stalts. Okay, so I'm guessing Saboteur and Sentinel will be the ones that I want to get up. But on the bright side, unlike Hope's uh, worthless fight, I actually get to play around with the configuration of paradigms. We'll give this one. I'll give this one more shot. And if I can't beat it this time, I'll do it off camera like it of Alexander. This one's already miles better than Hope's one, just because I don't have to skip a cutscene. I don't have to fucking sit there and just... Oh my god, it's so worthless. Like, I do have to skip a cutscene, but it's a lot easier because at least I get Paradigm play around in this one. <coughs> Ugh. <coughs> skip. Here we go, Paradigms, Customize. Mandor. Saboteur and Commando. That's fine, Saboteur and Sentinel. Let's try a Saboteur. And... Oh my god, could we go double Saboteur? Could we go... Could we? Oh, could we? I feel like we could. Oh my god, go down. Medic. Thank you. Jesus Christ. Saboteur? Uh, um... We'll do this one. As medic. And... Sentinel. Actually, you know what? Have I got Saboteur and Sentinel? Yes, I have. Okay, okay. Medic and Sentinel. Let's just try... I'm just gonna try whatever for this. This is literally last ditch before I do this off camera. Because I'm not... I'm not sitting through another one of these. I'm not sitting through another one of these. I'm so sick of these bloody Eidolons. Lightning's one, Saz's one, they were so easy. It, oh my god! 
bloody snars one. That was a joke. All you have to do is go sentinel and just defend the whole time. Like, that is actually a joke. Can we just go double saboteur for a sec? Can we just go double saboteur? Let's do it. Come on, Fang, saboteur with me. Or oh, do nothing! That works too, you useless... Do something, Fang! Okay, I guess nothing works too. I guess nothing works too, Fang. Thanks. What's the point of sending you to Saboteur if you don't do anything? Fucking do something! Fucking do something! Oh my god, what a joke. What a joke. Why is your staff now Tom Fizz? Uh, you know what, I'm just done questioning it. Please do something, Fang, my god. Oh my god, what is the point of having both of them on Saboteur if Fang's gonna sit there and do nothing? Do something! Okay, I'm gonna do this off camera, figure out what the hell the tactic is. Fuck me, I hate these bloody Eidolon fights. They add nothing to the game. They really add nothing to the game. Alright, give me one sec, I'll destroy this shit off screen and then we'll come back. Okay, I've done a... Done a few more attempts with Vanille and Fang fighting this bloody dude, and it just it just ain't working out. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna just leave this episode here for now. Like it's it's really good to be back. Like I don't know why my actual save game is all the way back here. Like, why does it swap all of a sudden? See, like, save data 6, 7, 4, 5, 3, 2, 1. It's never done that before. I'm very confused. <coughs> so what I'm going to do, I'm just going to save, I'm going to save it here. And next episode, I'll have beaten um, the Eidolon for the meal. I've played around with every conceivable setup for two characters with this. Um, I, I feel like I'm just doing one small thing wrong like I was with Alexander for hope. So, I'll have a play around, I'll see what I can do, and then start of the next episode <coughs> will be when I have defeated the idol on for Vanille, because my god, I'm not subjugating you guys, you guys to this, I've, I've done three attempts off camera, I get to the same point in each one, and then all of a sudden I just die, I don't know why, um, so much like Alexander, I'm just gonna have to play around with every conceivable setup, and just hope to Fuck the RNG works in my favor so that I can actually win that fight. But, yeah, so we'll leave this episode here. Um, I'm gonna be honest, it's great. It's great being back recording this game again. I'm not gonna lie, I've, I've actually really missed it. Um, so yeah, we're just gonna... And I am still playing, look. Do, 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 do. I'm still in control. So it's not just a, a bullshit, I am still playing. Alright. I'll see you guys in the next episode, where we'll have defeated the Eidolon. I'll start off, like, the, the second that battle's over, if a cutscene plays, I'll fucking pause it. And we'll just, we'll go from there. But until then, uh, thank you all. I will see you in the next one, where we'll defeat Vanille's Eidolon. And we'll continue with the fucking story. I I hate these Eidolon fights, man. Because I never fucking use the summons in this game. They're worthless. Uh. <coughs>
Well, I'll see you in the next one, guys. I hate these idle on fire, so I'll, I'll give it a... My God, I'll, I'll give it a fucking crack for you, though. Have a good one. See you in the next episode.